Hey what's going on guys, welcome back to another motion video, so in today's video we have a new bounty hunt and let me tell you, these glitches continue. But I'm not going to mention um, what the glitch is or tell you guys how to do it because I don't know, I don't want to risk getting banned, okay? So I'm not going to. But anyways guys, um, we are going to be taking a look at this new bounty hunt. I'm going to let you guys know whether I think that the um, exclusive monster, the one behind the paywall, if it's worth it or not. And on top of that, um, we are also going to just flip some tiles, have some fun, and on top of that, um, all the monsters like with the bounty coins which ones to purchase and which ones to not purchase i'm gonna let you guys know okay so i hope you guys are excited for today's video if you are smash the like button subscribe channel the case on anyways let's go ahead and get started all right so once you go ahead and log in make sure your game is updated by the way um you're gonna go ahead and join a group so it looks like this is going to be your first fugitive and what i've noticed is that this is just the first fugitive that everybody gets um so if i'm if i'm mistaken just let me know in the comments but on my main account i actually got this and now i'm on my baby account and as you guys can see i got the same exact uh, fugitive and the thing is um for the previous and previous bounty hunts i've just been getting this back to back so i'm pretty sure this is like the first bounty hunt monster that you actually get now you have about five stamina to, um stamina to actually use and here's the thing um, you can go ahead and use them, but make sure to use them accurately, okay? Here's what I mean. So for those of you that are new to Bounty Hunt, basically there are a bunch of tiles here. And what you want to do is find the Fugitive Monster, and then you attack it, you kill it to death, and then you get the rewards. But here's the thing. In order to find it, you need to follow the arrows. You see that these arrows that pop up? Uh, so the white color is mine. Um, let's say Monster Master 3088. I'm pretty sure that's an AI. Um, there will be AIs actually, by the way. Um, and I think that AI is not active right now. So yeah, but you will see different colors with the arrows. They don't really mean anything. It's just It just rep represents the player, basically. But anyways, so I flip my tile. And as you guys can see, the arrows pointing upwards. So that means that... Um, that are going to be towards the left or the right so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna do the right side and yep it is pointing towards the left side okay what if we do hmm what if we do right here that one's also pointing towards the right okay or upwards sorry so that means that there's something that has to be somewhere around here um hopefully oh look at that lucky shot but as you can see the um what's called the arrow it's still pointing upwards so that means that we haven't really found that specific reward but we just found something else that was close to it so what if we do this one Nope, okay. So as you can see, the arrow is pointing towards the left side. So that means that there's something hiding right here. Basically, there's a, some type of reward. Uh, but unfortunately, we ran out of stamina points. And you do regenerate stamina points every 30 minutes. So I guess you could kind of wait for it if you want to. Um, but what we're going to do is switch to our main account. So now that we're on our main account, here's what I'm going to do. Okay, so as you can see, there are about two other players. And there are actual players, by the way. And they're not AIs. Uh, they've went ahead and flipped some tiles. I went ahead and flipped the tile earlier. And as you can see, it's just like flipping to... Or, Sorry, it's pointing towards the left side, right? I have 14 stamina points because I purchased some earlier. But here's the thing. You want to just follow the arrows. So as you can see, these arrows right here. Um, it's telling me that there's something hiding right here. So maybe this buddy boy uh, were just flipping some tiles and couldn't exa exactly find it. So he just ran out of stamina. I got a lucky shot, but as you guys see, the arrows are still pointing. So that means that there's still something hiding in there. We didn't find that specific reward, but there was a reward right next to it, right? So this arrow right here, the buddy boy's arrow is pointing towards the left side right mine is pointing towards downside so that means that there's something right here has to be as you can see we went ahead and got a reward green bag these are the worst thing that you can possibly get uh the second best would be the red ones and then it moves on to i think yellow is there a yellow one i don't know i forgot um i completely forgot but there's something else and then the best one that you can get is the purple bags okay so here's what we're going to do um so as you can see there are no more tiles or arrows to follow so i guess we can create our own path so for example we're just gonna randomly choose this right here and as you can see it's pointing towards the upside we're gonna do this one pointing towards the left side it's best to kind of like um have your arrows you know um placed very very far from each other you know what i mean so they don't have to be super close that way you don't have to spend too many of these um bounty hunt stamina things stamina points uh so as you see this one is pointing towards the left side there has to be something around here maybe okay maybe this one maybe i don't know oops okay guess not um we're gonna choose this we have four more to play around with there, there is something right here hiding somewhere in here i just don't know where it is maybe this one one's points okay um how about uh okay but this one's already taken the pointing up here i'm not sure but um the arrows are just pointing upwards. This one's pointing upwards too. Which, um, which I'm kind of confused about. I, I'm kind of confused. Maybe it's somewhere around here, no? Because you can't really map on any of these things. It's literally just a bunch of 
garbage around, you know what I mean? They're not really tiles. So, let me exit, go back to it. Whoops, let's go back to Bounty Hunt. And, okay. So, yeah, I'm kind of confused about this, honestly. Maybe it is... Mm, <laughs> I honestly don't know. You know what? I'm just going to randomly choose this one. Okay, yeah, no, I don't know why I did that, but hold on. That one's just a lucky shot. But maybe it's somewhere up there, no? Has to be. Um, Let me do this one. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, so it's just pointing upwards, so that means that there's something hiding right here. Um, I should have noticed that. But anyways, um, as you can see, I don't know what league I'm currently in. It actually tells you once you try to look for the Fugitive Monster, but right now, I'm with these three players, I have 210 points, and I'm getting about 20 cells with 250 coins. Um, so th that's just the reward from 1 through 5th. As you guys can see, this is one of the newest uh, Mythic Monsters. This one's the free-to-play one, by the way. Um, it's really good. I highly recommend getting it uh, ranked up, especially to rank 3, if you can, because it'll start off with Megatons. And you guys know, Megaton monsters, they last for a very, very long time. This monster will be meta. So I highly recommend picking it up if you can, okay? Great Megaton monster. Um, so definitely pick that up. But anyways, if you head over to the portal here, um, you will see all these yields here, right here, okay? So first of all, I want to start off with this monster, okay? This is the exclusive pass one. Uh, sorry, exclusive pass, I said. Exclusive bounty hunt monster, right? Um, this is the Fugitive Killer. So if you want to use this, go for it. Um, I highly recommend picking it up. It is a good monster. Um, it has Pierce, Pierce mechanic, random status effects, Bane skill, by the way. That's a new torture, new status effect, sorry. Not really torture. Kind of, it works like a torture, but it's a status effect. Um, so it is a magic and fire attacker. So two elements, that's really good. Um, and it does have Pierce. So this is going to be our first Doom Pierce monster. And the thing with this monster is that you don't keep your Pierce, by the way. Um, and he doesn't really have it as a trait or status caster. So after you use it, you don't really keep your Pierce. It removes it. But here's what you can do. You can pair it up with Slumster. Uh, after applying positive effect protection, it'll basically just give her the positive effect protection. You can't really give her the pierce, it'll basically stay in him. Uh, so you can continue using that pierce over and over again with Slumster or any other monsters that applies positive effect protection. Like for example, the exclusive pass monster, okay? Um, so I do recommend picking this up. Get it rank 5 if you can. Um, Snow Girls, once again, you do want to pick this up. Get it to at least rank 3. Um, Piper Shock, I don't really recommend getting unless you just want it for collection purposes, guys, okay? Uh, besides that, Gahizel is amazing. Definitely pick this one up. This is like one of the meta monsters. Miramotis, another meta monster, fantastic. Has Taunt, Mega Taunt, really good. This monster is amazing as well. Quaste, um, really good, I've got to say. Definitely pick that up. Uh, Mega Taunt here. So if you want another Mega Taunt, you can go with Kenrai. Definitely pick it up. Cruel Electric isn't that bad, honestly. Um, I still like this monster. It has like... Light skills, fire, thunder, pretty good. Um, it's a curved monster, so it's a pretty good attacker still, in my opinion. This monster is fantastic as well. You can make some level 4 plays within Team Wars, you know, with the evasion and positive eye protection. Um, you can even run it with uh, Jaeger if you want to. Did I say Jaeger? Uh, Jaeger. I think that's his name, right? Jaeger. Um, but yeah, you can actually run it with him. Applying that positive eye protection, he won't really get rid of his peers after he uses his skill. This is the only monster that I recommend not picking up unless you just want it for collection purposes. This and also Piper Shock, guys. All right. Uh, but other than that, everyone else is worth it. Um, but yeah, these other things are just in there. They're nothing new. Um, so yeah, like I do recommend picking those up. It's just that maybe you should wait for when uh, Dr. Victor's patrons come out. You know, like that cell thingy, the cell week, where you actually purchase a bunch of cells when you spend your coins in Bounty Hunt. And then you get rewarded with like runes and other good stuff like food and things like that. So you can, I guess, wait for that if you want to. Or you can just spend your coins. Like I have 895 coins right now. I could just spend it all if I wanted to. But anyways, um, I think I will be purchasing like this real quick. 225 gems for the 50 bounty hunt stamina. Just for the purpose of this video because I want to flip some tiles and why not. Um, so let's do it, okay? Let's try to find ourselves the fugitive monster. Alright, let's do it. So... Um, we are going to get some cells. Uh, by the way, I actually don't mind getting the green bags this time. I actually like it more than the red one. You want to know why? Because, um, the green one actually gives you dreamer cells and I don't have dreamer max out. Honestly, I want to max it out. But the red ones, I already have a Kenrai rank 5. I already have a, you know, crew electric rank 5. Uh, but it does give you some other nice rewards, such as, for example, the gems and the other. So... I guess I'll accept that. I don't know why I just went with that tile. 
Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is not looking good. Um, hmm, okay, so the arrow is pointing to sword, uh, maybe up here? Yep, okay, cool. Yeah, I had to um, take care of that because I was just like commentating, just telling you guys some things here and there, and I completely forgot what I was doing. And I was just randomly like flipping tiles. Lucky shot, cool. All right, so, and it is going to be a red bag. Oh, man. But I guess I'll go ahead and take the gem and, of course, also the um, bounty hunt stamina. So I guess we'll take it. Um, but yeah, pointing downwards, pointing towards the right, so there has to be somewhere, something around here. Maybe it is this right here? Okay, this one's pointing downwards too. Hmm. Okay, um, let me see. Let me actually go around here. Lucky shot. We're gonna go ahead and take this real quick, whatever it is. It's a green bag, I'll take it, because I do want... I do like the green bags this time because it gives me dreamer cells, you know? I want to max up my dreamer if possible. Oh, look at that, another lucky shot right next to it. And again, the best bag that you can actually get would be the purple one. By the way, this um, the rewards that you obtain, it actually gets better and better um, the more you progress in the bounty hunt. So that's kind of sweet. But anyways, um, let me do this one. Okay, this one's pointing downwards too. I can't, wait, hold on. I want to try something. Um, is it this one? Can't be. Okay. Pointing downwards. Let me go with this one. Pointing downwards. Okay. We're going to go ahead and move our arrow a little bit further. Okay. Because I don't want to spend too many of these um, staminas. So what are we going to get from this? Oops. Some rewards. Okay. What about this one right here? Lucky shot again. Man, come on. <laughs> come on. Come on. I mean, I, I do enjoy this. You know, getting them back to back. But like, I'm trying to follow the arrows here. Okay. So what about this right here? Lucky shot again. Dang, I'm getting so lucky. Wow. <laughs> I'm getting pretty lucky. By the way, um, I'd love to talk about the bug that's still going on. I don't know if it's a bug or if it's a strategy. You guys can let me know in the comments. If it's a strategy and it is okay for me to make a video on it, then I need you guys to let me know in the comments and I'll take your words for it. But if it's a bug that's going on, then I don't want to really use it and I don't want to make a video to make it popular. Um, although I do love bounty hunts and things like this you know this and that um and i'm sure you guys will enjoy um you know a video where i actually post about the strategy or bug whatever it is something went wrong yeah this actually happens sometimes when the player tries to flip the same tile as you at the same time all right so we're back all right um i just had to reload my game all right we're gonna go ahead and take this one let's go ahead and move our arrow a little bit this way Oh, that's a lucky shot, but um, the fugitive is actually hiding somewhere around here, so we need to find it before someone else does, because I do want my gems. I do want the 25 gems that it gives, so please, please, please give me my gems before this other player takes it, because I don't want this player to actually take it. Come on, stop giving me these lucky shots, man. Just give me the fugitive monster. Come on, I just want to find it. Can it be here? Oh, it has to be somewhere around here. It's literally somewhere around here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Has to, be, has to be. Hold on, hold on. Let me go ahead and move my tail a little bit. Okay. Uh, maybe this one right here? Has to be. Oh, it's somewhere up here. Never mind. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Now we're getting a little closer. Hold on. Hold on. It, it's literally somewhere right here. It's literally somewhere around here. I, I promise you. I promise you. Okay. Watch this. It's literally somewhere around here. Uh, we just have to keep on moving some tiles here and there and wait for it. Somewhere right here. Hold it. Uh, okay, this one. Yep, okay, thought so. <laughs> oh, it's only 10 gems. I thought it was uh, 25 gems. All right, so we are back and we got another fugitive. It is going to be Monster Plant. Monster Plant will give us 25 gems for finding it and so on. Um, and I think this is the League 2, right? This is League 2 or 3? It's one of them. No, it's League 3, I think, because we already defeated the other two. Um, but yeah. So this is going to be League 3 and it gives you about 25 gems and it's Monster Plants. Okay, now it's, many players will probably have something different. But anyways, okay, Phil. Phil, my boy Phil is actually pretty active and he already went ahead and used all of his tiles. Yeah, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You used all of them. All 5 Staminas. Cool. I have 6 remaining. We might as well go ahead and use them. So we got a Lucky Shot on our first one. Yeah, we've been getting lots and lots of Lucky Shots. We've been getting lots of them. All right, um, that is going to give us some gems. It is going to be two gems now, seven cells for the mythics. We got another lucky shot, just like that. Um, and we got a green bag this time, so that's good because I want these seven dreamer cells. And there's something that is hiding somewhere around here. Maybe it's here. 
Okay, it's going to point it towards the right side. Maybe it's right here. Nope. Okay. Um, has to be here, no? Okay, now I'm just guessing. Hold on. Maybe here? Oh, okay. We have no more stamina. Um, but yeah, it's something that's like somewhere around here, basically. Or if not, somewhere up there. Uh, but you guys basically get the idea about this new bounty hunt, right? Once again, make sure that your game is updated. Um, and once again, I do recommend picking up the Fugitive Hater, Snow Girls. They're both really worth it. All these monsters that you see here are worth it, except the Lightmare Monster and Piper Shock. Only get them for collection purposes. But everyone else that you see in here, you should get them maxed out if you can. Um, but anyways, so besides all of that, um, I hope this video actually kind of helped you guys out. And on top of that, I do want to let you guys know that there is an offer right now in Monster Gens that will actually give you 5,000 gems for about 100 bucks. But what you can do is maybe you can purchase, um, purchase it using Amazon Coin so you get some discount on it you know what i mean uh, with the amazon coins but it's up to you if you want to do it i just wanted to help you guys out all right uh but you can only purchase it once i might actually purchase it i don't know i'm still thinking about it um i should i don't know if i should purchase this one or if i should purchase the rank 5 um jagger monster this one right here i'm still thinking <laughs> anyways guys i hope you guys did enjoy today's video if you did smash like button subscribe to the notification and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out